know, for each of the four years I've been in the legislature, we've tried to do something that is so simple, such a common sense solution, and really a free market solution, that would save us all a lot of money. What we want to do is use the state's buying power to negotiate discounts with drug companies. For the first two years, I watched that bill die in the legislature. For the last two, it got vetoed. Meanwhile, all over the world, other countries are doing it and saving their citizens billions of dollars. States all across America are doing it and saving their citizens hundreds, tens of millions of dollars while we've sat back and paid full price for prescription drugs. Next year, we are going to get that bill through. And we're going to start saving people money. And not only will all of us save money, we're then going to take those discounts and pass it on to every Colorado who doesn't have health insurance. That right there will go a long way towards solving some people's serious problems with health care. And I'm looking really forward to that. A couple of other things we're going to work on. We're going to keep trying to improve education. We promised that we would take a third of the FC money and put it into education. We did that. I sponsored the, sponsored the School Finance Act. We took that money and we used it to help school districts deal with the cost of special education. We're training highly qualified teachers. We're reducing class sizes. And we're putting more kids into preschool so they show up for kindergarten and first grade ready to learn and they can then prosper throughout their careers. But the really exciting thing that I think holds all of the promise for this state has to do with renewable energy. You know, we've been a real leader in fossil fuels. We had coal, we had oil, we had natural gas, we've made a lot of money for it. But it's time now to look into the future and decide how are we gonna power our economy, our lives into the future. Well, we have wind, we have sun, we have the National Renewable Energy Labs, we have CU, we have the School of Mines, we have everything we need to be as dominant in renewable energy as we have been in fossil fuels. And with a little bit of coordination from the state and maybe a little bit of money, we can start attracting companies here that will create great jobs, careers for people, helping develop the energy sources of the future. And when you put all of that together, we're going to have kids who are going to be doing well in school, colleges that can train them for their careers, and then we're going to have the businesses here that will help us move on into the 21st century with the kind of jobs that will help us, the entire country, adapt to new realities. We've moved away from this ideological legislature where everything was tied up in some utopian view of what some philosopher thought to a really practical legislature where we're looking at the real world problems, finding real world solutions, and it's exciting. And I'm really looking forward to being a part of it. I hope you will vote for me and help me go back to the legislature and accomplish some of the things we've been working on for a few years. Absolutely. Thank you very much.